Uh, well, I've been here at the uh, Garneville Arts Center for about eight years now. I was uh, one of the many arts refugees from Manhattan when I lost studios in Chelsea and Williamsburg and Long Island City due to gentrification. So I came up this way, found this place, and it's just a fantastic place for a sculptor. Big old industrial buildings and uh, hopefully I get to stay a while here. And uh, I came up here again about eight years ago and started doing these big brick pieces. I, uh, Garnerville here is near Haverstraw, New York, which is the historical home of modern brick making. And when I moved up and read about that, that was what gave me the idea of using a brick technique with ceramics to do these large scale pieces, which I have been working on since. Uh, It's a fascinating material that I've just grown to love, and uh, this is a great place to do it. Carnival Art Center. I've had a studio here for many, many, many years, and I've watched the whole development of Gaga and the, the, the development of this community of artists, which is which has been terrific. We have sometimes in pretty splendid light that comes in and does all kinds of things in the studio, but it's, it's also my space. Sometimes when I'm working, I think I, I've made a bubble here. I have my, my, my books that I need, the poetry that I need, my art materials. This is just an artificial bubble, and then I think this is what an artist needs to have this kind of sanctuary, this enclosed space in which to create. So I feel very lucky to have it. Whenever I leave this space, uh, my eyes are quite active. And when I walk out, I see gorgeous things in the buildings, uh, the bricks, obviously, and the, the roofscapes and the trees and the light. It's just gorgeous.